I always say it's, it, the Brussels is the most beautiful mistake that Europe has ever made. My name is Abdullah Al Omari. I'm a visual artist, uh, painter, filmmaker, and performance artist. Uh, Syrian Brasilier. I left Syria. I was uh, working as a as a painter on on a project documenting victims, ch children victims of of uh, the war. At that time, it was like uh, clearly opposing the regime. So it became also more more uh, more complicated for me to stay so i had to leave it's a totally an authoritarian dictatorship saying your mind in any way in your in your in your uh, well, verbally or in your tools and art it is dangerous there was always this constant fear of of doing that the the project is consists of uh, paintings you would see uh, figures that, that look quite vulnerable, quite like could be, they could be poor, they could be uh, homeless. And you would go closer to, to, the, to the face and then you would realize that, wow, these people are Obama, Trump, Merkel, uh, Putin, Bashar al-Assad. So you would see the, the, their familiar faces in this uh, imaginary position. My aim in the beginning, the trigger that, that made me think about working on this project was, was uh, was basically my personal experience as, a, as an exiled person. I wanted to see them in the shoes of these people, of these, uh, of these vulnerable people, of refugees, of displaced people, to see if they would, these great uh, individuals that are supposedly great, divine almost for some, some people, would they still be able to demonstrate their greatness or divinity when, when they become in, in this new image? I always say it's it, the Brussels is the most beautiful mistake that Europe has ever made. This randomness that happened naturally with with all the different uh, cultures and ethnicities and immigration that happened since the 60s of the last century, see, being able to to see all the different people around you without having a problem with it, without having to to look like them, to act like them. You can do your thing, I can do my thing. We can still use the same metro and live next to each other and etc. It, it just became this Brussels. It became the whole world in a, this tiny geography. So that's, that's kind of the first step to an ideal world, I think.